settlement in relation to the exhibition we had here and from that day a bunch of people from Napakiaka said it's time we had our own exhibition along those lines of contemporary photographs and tell our story. You are the Tangata Whenua, but you have been joined by those whose presence comes with a genuine desire to build a strong, equal partnership. We have two cultures, two heritages, and in the past we've been looking in very different directions. But history haunts the generations who refuse to acknowledge it. I hope this exhibition will help all people to acknowledge your history and to celebrate what you have achieved. In one sense, we've started uh, as the history of the, the Kurahopo settlement, but if people look around tonight, you'll see Mulberrian in every one of these photos. And I think that was one of the things we wanted to show as well, that uh, a previous mayor had said, settlements for iwi are good for the community. And the chairperson of the Kurahopo Trust was Richard Bradley. His words at the time were marked with optimism. <laughs> no pressure. By no stretch of the imagination could those 162 years of negotiation, dispute, claim and counterclaim be described as an easy journey. The name Na Pakiaka Morihu Te Whenua is a metaphor for the people of the land whose roots, like the indigenous forest, are still firmly embedded in the soil. We love the concept. Um, it's been an absolute pleasure um, to be involved in this exhibition and to work with many of you as you and have worked with over the years. The, the exhibition goes back to 1840, 17th of June, and in the last few years, um, the local people here have taken a have used that date to commemorate the signing of the Treaty of Waitangi out at Hora Hora Kākahu. Uh, I'm of the belief that if, if something is good, um, the Modi takes you along the way and lots of good things have happened in the process of getting this exhibition up and running. Uh, and there's, as people have mentioned before, we've had some really cool things happen in our community in the last week. The, the, the opening of the Pawananga up at Omaka is just a, an amazing uh, testament to the, uh, to the tenacity of our, our people. Good turnout. I think there were possibly, I don't know, 100 odd people. 
So that was really cool. We're taking part in the signing of in the treaty settlements and also the bringing back of our ancestors to our pa. Um, all those emotions just keep flooding back. So I think tonight is a uh, very, very special night for those of us that were involved in those in those events. So you've gone from obviously you've gone around the wall from different ages and ended up with the next generation, which is, is what it's all about, isn't it?